thank you for joining me for another exciting episode of Ghost Hunters. Today, we are at the residence of Mr. Butch Hess and Shirley Earnhardt. Apparently, they have some really bad spirits nestled into their home. And we're going to try and see if we can help them out at all. So let's go and see what they need from us. Apparently, this house was built over an ancient Indian burial ground, so if that's true, we're in for some fun. I don't know where they are. You'd think they'd be eager and ready to see what we can do for them. Oh, wait a second. Perhaps they're over there. Butch, Shirley, you in there? What the hell are you doing, you son of a bitch? Whoa, 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 hey. Get off my property. What the hell you think you're doing here? I have to mind to put a plug in your head. What the hell you think you're doing? Butch, it's me, Chad, from Ghost Hunters. I'm here to help you out with your ghost problem. Did you get him, Butch? Did you shoot him? Did you get him? So, Butch, is there anything in particular that you want us to investigate while we're here? Yeah, just last week we were trying to go to sleep, and there was these weird sounds coming from a bedroom. I don't know what it was all about. It was really weird, though. I don't know what was going on. You better investigate this stuff. We're getting really scared over here, man. We get really scared over here. Yeah. There was some really scary stuff around in the bathroom too. There was this really weird light, and then something went over by the mirror. I didn't want to see it. I was really scared. And after that, we had to go and hide in the shed for the rest of the night. I didn't want to go back in there. I was so scared. Oh, I had to hold on to Butch, and it was so scary. All I could think of was Dale Jr. I didn't know what to do about it, but it was so scary. So Butch, you and Shirley are married, right? Why is her last name Earnhardt then? Yeah, yeah, it's a pretty long story. I really love Dale Jr. He's just my favorite driver in NASCAR ever. I just wish that I could marry him. I had to change my last name to Earnhardt just to signify the fact that I love him so much. I really wish that I could meet him one day. That's all I could ever dream of. I'm surely changed her name to Earnhardt back a couple of years ago. It really made me mad. It felt like Dale Jr. himself had come over and stolen my wife away from me. I swear. If I ever see Dale Jr. in real life, I'm going to knock him out, and while I look at him groveling on the ground, I'm going to say, that's for taking my wife, you son of a bitch. All right, then. Well, that's just about everything we need to know, so we'll set up some cameras, and we'll investigate throughout the night, and we'll see you tomorrow. How's that sound? So we worked throughout the night, and we got a couple of pieces of evidence that we're going to share with Butch and Shirley right now, so let's go. All right, so yesterday you told us that you heard some strange sounds coming out of your bedroom one night. Well, we set up a recorder outside your bedroom door, and we think we've caught some evidence that you would like to hear. So I'll give this to you, and you can listen. <laughs> wow, man, that, that, that's really weird. Wow. I, I don't believe that. Wow. And that's not all. You said that you saw something strange in the bathroom yesterday. Well, we set up a camera overnight in the bathroom as well. And what we saw is a little surprising. Once again, check it out. Butch, our house is hot and it's still oh my god. What are you gonna do, Butch? I, I, I can't, I can't handle it. I can't handle it. Shirley, Shirley, you can't run like that. That just shows your weakness. Now the ghosts are gonna target you even more. <laughs> 
Come on, Shirley. Come back. Well, this got really awkward really fast. 